I was trying to always describe what it feels like to bomb, you know? And like one of the ones, the, this, the things I came up with was like, have you, uh, it's, it's like professing your love to someone in front of people. That's perfect. In front of people. That is so perfect. And then the person's like, uh, no. Yeah. <laughs> and you're like, um, like, <laughs> dude, I have nothing. Right? And you're like, <laughs> <laughs> you just want to die. I have zero to add to that. Yeah. That is the best, most accurate description. Of bombing. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. That's, that it's, is it. It's like, yeah, professing your love and get rejected is embarrassing enough. Yeah. Imagine you doing that in front of people. In front of people. exactly what it is. Yeah. I mean, it's, it almost reminds me of those, you've seen those clips of the guy uh, proposing like at a game. Yeah. And the girl's like, no, nah, no. Nah. And you're like, yeah. oh. <laughs> like, that has to feel, I mean. Your skin gets hot. Yeah. Like your skin starts, you know, it feels like you have COVID. Like your skin gets hot. Yeah. You want to get out of your skin. You want to get out of your body. You have an out-of-body experience. Like you feel lightheaded. You can feel the blush. You can yeah. feel the the blood rush in your cheeks. It's and you, just, you remember them too. Like, you know, if, once you have stand up for a long time, you've done... You've done thousands of hours of stand-up, basically, right? You've done just so many shows. And if somebody were like, do you remember great moments? You're like, yeah, I remember, you know, I remember like a couple zings back in the moment at Heckler's. I remember shows that were like rock shows where you're like, Jesus Christ, like beginning to end, this was unbelievable as an experience, right? Like, but you go, man, those like bombs they have a special category in your memory. Oh, yeah. Like, I mean, I can remember like a year one and year two uh, doing sets. You know, these are like bringer shows and stuff where like I'd say a line and, and just hearing someone, there's 25 people going like, oh, God. <laughs> like just saying that. <laughs> and you're like, and you're not prepared for it. Yeah. It's not like someone saying it now nah, yeah. where you know how to address it. And say, yeah. You just were like, and you just, you know, you could feel your whole body get hot. And, and, you're, and what it feels like is it feels like someone is mock. Imagine someone mocking you. Yeah. That's what you feel like you're being mocked. Yeah. You're being bullied. It feels like yeah. you're being bullied. Yeah. Yeah. And you're, all, you're also the most, you're the only one being vulnerable. Yeah. So yeah. it's almost, it's a version of being like, I want to tell you how I feel today. It's one's being like, oh, Jesus yeah. Christ. And you're like, it's it the just, reason why guys don't talk about their feelings in front of their guy friends. Exactly. Because like as soon as they say something in front of them, the guy's like, come, don't be a girl. Yeah. And yeah. You're like, I'm sorry. I'm yeah. not, I didn't, you know. I'm then, just going to go eat more. Yeah, I'm just going to go eat more and, <laughs> yeah. and just and lie. I'm going to yeah. lie about how I feel all yeah. the time. All the time, yeah. I just, I'm scared we just, did we just like encourage someone because you were like, I only remember, I remember a few heckles. No. There's someone out there going like, I'm going to go to Tom's show and Giannis' show Look, and make it memorable. Nah, because here's the thing. <laughs> Don't us, do that. Us and everybody there hates you. Yeah. And like it happens anyway. There's people heckle all the time. Um, I mean, the only difference now is that, you know, I have fucking mercenaries at the show that'll break your neck. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the deal. I don't. So please just sit in silence. Sit in fucking silence, please. Yeah. No, it's like because someone charges stage on me, I'm just gonna take it like one of those high school beatings where you just curl up <laughs> and you just take Timberland boots to the head. Just, <laughs> oh, God, it, it, there's nothing like bombing, dude. It is the fucking worst. It's the fucking worst. It's it's it is that is the perfect that is I've never even thought about trying to find an analogy for it. Yeah, and like I don't think there's a better one. Bert and Tom, Tom and Bert. One goes topless while the other wears a shirt. Tom tells stories and Bert's the machine. There's not a chance in hell that they'll keep it clean. Here's what we call Two Bears, One Cave. 